As of right now, we are both on Easter break from university. So, we're going to make use of it by having a nice little getaway of sorts. So, what is this getaway that we have planned? So we booked three nights away in the Sidings Hotel, which is just above York or off the East Coast Main Line. And well, this uh, hotel of which you speak is a rather cool hotel, isn't it? It is indeed. We'll uh, find out very shortly, but firstly we actually need to get to the place. We're currently in a car park <laughs> in Nesborough because um, we actually left quite early this morning and we've sort of just stopped off here uh, just for some mooching about. But uh, yeah, we're going to finally continue. We're going to get in my car that's right here and we'll just drive the rest of the way. Don't need that anymore. Get rid of that ticket. Welcome to my uh, tiny, tiny Citroen C1. <laughs> Driving a car is not really what you'd expect from a uh, channel about railway travel. But hey, here we are. So basically, in summary, this place we're going to is a converted railway carriage on a former sidings um, on the East Coast Main Line near York. So, I think it'll be pretty interesting. We're going to be staying there for, I think it's three nights, right? Yeah, that we're staying for. So, we'll just go there and have a little look around the place. So, we'll give a tour around our hotel room and the hotel grounds as well because there's a few like viewing areas from the East Coast mainland which is really cool. There's also a lot of like railway memorabilia and stuff inside the the hotel restaurant area. Oh, station. I guess it's referring to uh, cattle, I'd assume. Or Hamilton. I mean they're quite close so. We were visiting those earlier this afternoon. We sort of went on a nice little rail bash between uh, Nesborough and Poppleton. This road that we're on, the A59, basically directly follows the um, the railway line between Nesborough and York. Um, so it's like right to our right there. I wonder whether we'll see any trains. Probably not. There's like a little hedge, so. I hope we do. It. That'd be nice. <laughs> that would be cool. That'd be great. Just down there is Poppleton Station. Can't see it that well, but. This is the same road I came on that rail replacement bus that one time from Durham to York. Ugh, it's all coming back to me. Right, so we're just a few minutes away now. Not long till we're finally there. And we just passed over the East Coast Main Line there. Unfortunately, it's all blocked off by a wall, but... You see much of it, there you go. Hey. <laughs> we're now one minute away. Not far. Just entering the county of North Yorkshire as well, apparently. Very excited. <laughs> here we are. Great. And here we are, there it is. A nice oh, wow. carriage. Oh my god. <laughs> Hopefully this parking spot should be good. Nice, alright. Good drive. Turn off the lights. I made that mistake once before and I'm not doing it again. Right then. Not bad. This is so weird, what the hell? <laughs> right, number nine, apparently. We're in the uh, Orient Express. Brilliant. Right as we get here, freight train passing. And it's right next to the window as well. This is mad, oh my goodness. <laughs> having fun there, poking your head out the window. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's, it's a bit stiff. <laughs> All right, yes, a little compartment of an old Mark I, possibly? I'm not fully sure if they're all the same, but this looks kind of like a Mark I carriage. I don't really know my old trains, very sorry. Um, but yeah, so we've got this bedroom right here. Also got the uh, bathroom in here with a, a mirror with a nice little uh, double arrow on it, <laughs> just for good measure. So we're actually at the lights in here. It's a bit dark, is that? Ah, there we are. There, that's better. Nice. It's a bit dark on camera. Anyway, this is all uh, great and exciting, but we should probably actually get our stuff. We've sort of just left it in the car. There we go. Perfect. Got some more fancy light switches here. What do these do? Hello. Oh, bl I see. Oh, that's cool. That's that's pretty neat. <laughs> it's like sort of 
Christmas lights, but not quite. So, how much was this to book? Again, it was, um... <laughs> so, per night, I think we paid £89 for both of us. So, each, that cost us almost, like, 40 quid. But that also includes a full English breakfast in the morning. So, like, for three nights, we got a bargain. To I be think. honest, for something like this, I'd say this is quite the bargain. It's so much cheaper than hotels in London, and this is so much more <laughs> worth it. You're right next to the East Coast <laughs> Main Line. Like, how much better can you get? Exactly. Not very. I'll give it that. Apparently, we are located just north of Skelton Junction, so I'm uh, paying close attention to a lot of the uh, services coming through here. The next one from now is apparently a King's Cross to Aberdeen service, so... Uh, should be coming any second now. I'm gonna pick my head out the window. Find the train. Wait. <laughs> that wasn't LNER. That was, that was, that was, what? I see, so that's what we figured out what happened. That cross country was delayed by 20 minutes. That's why we didn't see it. Oh. <laughs> but the zoom should be coming like now. Oh my God. Oh, how brilliant. <laughs> Hi. Hi. How you doing? <laughs> What? <laughs> Still not the LNER to Aberdeen. I. Honest to God. I hear one no, more no, train. No, no, is this finally it? Is this finally it? It is. It is. There we are. There we are. Finally. Third. Uh, third time's the charm. <laughs> right. Close the window now. It's. Freezing. Here's a little outsidey bit. Oh, yep, there's a TPE train coming right now. Very rare I ever really get an opportunity to sort of stand right next to the East Coast Main Line. I mean, I've done it once before, I, when we um, we had a walk from... Um, was next it like Durham Station, like there's a nature reserve just the other side of it. It's beautiful. Yeah. Like, you, you can just see right onto the train line and you've got nice views of like the, the valley. Uh, of but, as well. but this, you can stand right next to it, which is great. <laughs> Look at this little cart they've got here. That's, that's great. Oh my God. What's, um, what's this sign as well? So I don't know what this is. Someone in the comments will probably let me know. Right, well, if any hotel offers me a, a kettle and uh, tea bags, of course I'm making myself a cup of tea. Right, there we go. Nice. I'm truly at my peak making tea in a railway carriage hotel. Right, I've been able to make a cup of tea in here. Perfect. Right, well, that was uh, very nice. Shall we go ahead and uh, get dinner at the bar that's here. Yeah, let's go get some food. Let's, oh uh, my god, our face is we're so... We're so blue, blue. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, well, let's go and do it. Right, well, this is cool. Got a whole, like, compartment in a dining carriage. There's the uh, original alarm thing up there. Penalty 50 quid. Also got the uh, open window for ventilation and the heater thing, which probably doesn't work, but I'm not going to mess with it. It's got a cute little, like, beer garden. I can imagine that's, like, really nice in summer. People are just sitting outside, drinking some thing and watching the trains go by. That'd be amazing. It's just very cosy, isn't it? It is. It's like, it's, it's so good. <laughs> All right, here we are. It's here. So, bon appetit. I do wonder, actually, if, like, in a few decades' time, they'll have hotels like these again, but with like maybe Mark III coaches instead. Cause like, I guess some people would be able to come to here and have remembered these trains in actual passenger service. Just something to think about. Right, so we are back from our uh, very nice dinner. Mm. That, was, that was very good. Lovely. Yes, so uh, yes, the Sidings Hotel near York. This is honestly great. <laughs> this was a good choice. You found yeah. this place in the first place. So yes, thank you. Honestly, brilliant. Definitely worth the price, the very small price that it was, and the yeah. nice little getaway. Absolutely. Weekend away or something. But yeah, this was a uh, fairly different video than usual, so I uh, hope you enjoyed. hope it worked out somewhat. <laughs> <laughs> Experimenting a little bit. Um, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment, and a subscribe. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Bye.
And of course, a huge shout out to all of my patrons and channel members who are listed on screen now. Thank you all very much for supporting the channel.